Happy Mother's Day weekend. I hope y'all, all, all you moms out there are enjoying a little R&R &R and whatnot. Okay, so today I'm coming at you with um, a wallet that I told you that I had ordered from a company that's actually here in Texas called Love 41. It's a little continental wallet. Actually, it's not little at all. Um, and so I want to do just a quick review on it. This particular wallet, um, like I said, it's from Love 41. Love 41 apparently is the sister company for Saddleback Leather. They are based here in Texas. And um, I think in one of my other videos, I said that, that they were made in the U.S. They're not. They're actually made in old uh, Mexico. Not to be mistaken with, you know, New Mexico, Santa Fe. I'm, I mean like old Mexico, like south. So um, I, I just wanted to clarify that because I think I did say, hey, I found a wallet and it's made in the U.S. Okay, it's not made in the U.S. It's uh, the companies in Texas, in the U.S., and I guess they design everything or whatever, but they actually... The manufacturing takes place in old Mexico, okay? So, all right, so again, it's the Continental Wallet, and this thing's not cheap. It's $150, and um, I got it because I had been looking for a wallet that was, you know, made by, uh, that was all leather, that wasn't like your big, you know, your big brother corporations, like Fossil, you know, I had that Fossil wallet and stuff, but I, I really wasn't having any luck finding a zip wallet because most of the wallets that I see um, that are you know with these all other companies are usually like a it's a big wallet like a checkbook wallet But it's a trifold or whatever and I don't like those because whenever I'm opening up my wallet I don't want it to just go out like that like an accordion I, I need everything to be like right here, and I have been using a, a zip wallet for uh, Off and on mainly on for really as long as I can remember I, I don't ever use compact wallets unless I'm going on vacay or date night or mom's not out or whatever but my day-to-day -day wallet has always pretty much been, I would say 90% of the time has been a zip wallet. So this is what it looks like. It comes in one color and, um, and they call it caramel brown. It's got this cute stitching on both sides and of course this is the back and it has a, a nice, what is this, the antique brass uh, YKK zipper. And so this is super convenient, you know. It's, it's very much like, okay, so you know before I was using this one, I was using the Sackroots wallet. Everything about it is the same, except for, okay, so when I pulled it out of the packaging, I, um, I know I'm all over the place. I'm so sorry. So I get, the, I get the box yesterday, right? I pull it out of the box, and it was packaged in this cute little burlap sack, little drawstring burlap sack with this really cute little um, tag, Love 41. And, um, of course, the wallet was in this plastic, and it was inside of the burlap bag, and I pulled it out. And when I first pulled it out, I was like, ooh, she big. Um, and so I was kind of like, ooh, I don't know, because I have actually purchased, um, I think, no, I didn't do a video on it. Well, I was using this one uh, Louis Vuitton wallet. It was from the men's line, and it was more of like a, oh, I forgot what it's called. It's like an organizational wallet, but it's more like a travel, like a, it's just like a, a zip wallet like this, but just bigger. And so I was like, oh, dang, I don't know. It's, it's kind of big. I don't know. And then I started thinking, okay, well, what's their refund policy, their return policy? Am I going to be able to return it if I don't like it because it does seem kind of big and because it's all leather it's I mean it's heavy you know it's a little heavier so obviously it's just gonna add more weight to your bag right well when I pulled out my sack roots I'm like okay it's not that much bigger than the sack roots okay you can't even really tell like it's literally you can see it's probably what a centimeter or so um okay now I was just gonna measure for you so and the, and the size of this one is pretty much like the ones that you normally see. It's the same size as that fossil wallet that I did. And pretty much every other zip wallet that I've had um, is about this size. And so these sizes, and I'm only measuring, because you know how like the fabric zipper, well, not the fabric, but the zipper sticks out more. So I'm actually just measuring from the edge of, you know, like where the glazing is. Okay, so typically, oh wait, that's the wrong side. Okay, so normally these wallets are like seven and a half by, and I'll just do this, by four and a half-ish, four and a quarter. That's usually what they are. And then they're, you know, almost, not quite an inch deep, but almost. Okay, so this one is, again, and I'm just going not from the zipper uh, fabric, but like the actual piece of leather. This one is, it's, okay, so it's eight. Well, almost eight. I mean, it's like just short of eight inches wide. So see, it's just a tad bigger. It's not... It wasn't enough, I guess, for me to be worried about sending it back. And then it's um, a little bit taller than, than the other. Wait, what did I say this one was? I forgot. What did I say? 
Oh, okay, yeah, so four. This one is just slightly over four. Actually, no, it's not. I guess it just depends on where you put the put the ruler. When I put it right here on the fabric, okay, yeah, it is. Literally, it's like maybe four and a quarter, just under four and a quarter. So as you can see, and then it's what? Same, same depth, okay. So there wasn't a whole lot of room. I mean, you know, difference in this size and then the normal one, you know what I'm saying? And so like as I was thinking that, I start looking at this little tag, okay, and it says on the back here, Jean-Claude, Tita, Bahati, John Bosco, Alice, Kellen, Selena, Emmanuel. A hundred percent of the profits from this design help each of these people and many, many more. So shoot, I was like, oh, well, if I send it back, then that means all these little people aren't going to be helped. And then I felt bad. I was like, well, okay. I was like, well, it's fine. But then again, once I pulled out my sack roots, I was like, okay, it's not that much bigger. It's fine. Like, it's totally fine. So, um, it does. The only thing that I think is kind of bizarre is that, like, the zipper pull, the color's completely different. I don't know if they're trying to match, like, the little stitching there, maybe. Or just add a little something, something. I'm, I'm not really sure. But I, I just wish that there either, A, was not a zipper pull because the zipper, the zipper tab, as you can see, is pretty big just by itself. And I know I can cut it off. I know I can do that. Or if, if it was just matching this. You know, that's just, that's just my little tidbit. Um, my personal opinion, but this zipper, the one that like actually goes all the way around it, that closes it, like it's a chunky zipper. This is the size of zipper like you would see on a duffel bag. Like this isn't no coin pouch zipper. Like, see the size of this zipper on the sack roots? You know, you probably don't see much of a difference. I bet you're like, what, Angel? You're smoking crack. Okay, it's it really it. The zipper is bigger. I'm telling you. Maybe you could tell if I zipped it up. Okay, let's try it again. Okay, there. Maybe it's okay. Here's what it is. I guess they're the same size, like they're both the same width, but the teeth on this one are just more chunky. I think that's what it is. So the teeth on the zipper are chunky. But I like I like chunky. I like chunky zippers. I like chunky hardware. So it doesn't bother me at all. I was just telling you, I was just spending 50 minutes here telling you about the zipper. Okay, so you open it up. Um, and again, it's just like pretty much every other zip wallet of this silhouette that you've seen okay so it's got six so there's 12 C, uh, credit card slots uh yes that's awesome plus there is a bill compartment over here and I, I don't keep i like i have a strategy you know about how i keep my cards and what you know like i have just certain anyway it doesn't matter but i have like a you know a little gift card to world market so just I have like a couple of gift cards and so I keep those in this bill slot and then of course all my cards here and then on the other bill slot that's where I actually keep the greenbacks okay and then I have of course my cards my card right there and then the zipper I use this interior zipper pocket for coins I don't use the outside one for coins Um, I don't really know now I know in the past I have used this out when I've had zip wallets that have, see this one doesn't even have one. In the past, when I've had zip wallets that have this on the outside, I do use it for coins. So at this point, I don't have anything to use. I don't have a, I don't know what I'm going to do, do with that, with that a zip pouch. But right here is where I use the coins, or put the coins. And so then, you know, pretty much receipts just get thrown right here. So, I mean, I love this. I, I really, oh, and then on the inside, I was just noticing, okay, so inside of this where the bill pouches are it's got like a uh, most wallets you see now okay including the sack roots they have this cheapy crap material see even though they've got like this cute little tag and all that the actual material in here is like it's almost like nylon it's super thin and they even have this interior in their bags too and it's just thin I hate you know I really do not like cheapy interior lining I just it's just super annoying and this is almost like a waxed canvas and you know if you've ever had anything with wax canvas it's pretty hardy and so anyway I like that and it's kind of like an army green I know you can't really tell in the video but it's like an army green and so the wallet is really very well made not to mention that mmm it smells good y'all smells good uh, but the green kind of matches your money see look at that well at least it coordinates there you go huh you say hey hey what's up okay so yeah I really, um, oh, that wasn't what I was going to show you. 
Okay, so see, uh, see right here in the little stamp, it says made in old Mexico, like I said, old, not to be confused with Santa Fe, New Mexico or Albuquerque or whatever. It's like old Mexico, south of the border. And you're probably wondering why I'm throwing in a little bit of accent, old Mexico. Well, you probably don't know by looking at me, but mama's half Hispanic. Oh yes, she is. So I know what's up in the south of the border. You know what I'm saying? So, okay, here you go. Here it is. And then on the front, they have their cute little stamp, the Love 41. And if you go to their website, and I'll put it in the description, but if you go to their website, you will see that um, uh, this gal, what's her name? Her name is Suzette. I think it's Suzette. She's super passionate about, um, so, there's some, she went to some mission trip, I think, with her church a few years ago or whatever. And, um, and I forgot exactly where, and I'm, I'll just say, I'm not going to get into it. You can just go to her website and read about it. But anyway, she just felt, you know, super convicted to how can she be a part of it? What can she do? And so hence, uh, Love 41 was born. Um, and I, I'm pretty sure that the Love 41 is after Psalm 41. If you're familiar with the Bible, go to Psalm 41 and read it. And that is kind of like the foundation of, you know, her, her business. So again, um, they're out of Texas, Love 41. I love the packaging. I love these little tags. I really do. I think it's really neat when people take care, you know, put special care into their packaging and how they deliver their products. I think that's nice. Instead of just like throwing it in a box, you know what I'm saying? So I think that's really sweet. So anyway, again, this is the Continental Wallet, leather wallet, um, which technically this is not a Continental style. I, I, I'm pretty sure a Continental style is the fold out. Um, that's okay. That's neither here nor there. This is just a zip wallet. This is called a zip wallet. Um, but yeah, this is a great size. I like it. Um, it's a keeper. You know, for the two seconds I thought about returning it, once I saw Jean-Claude and all those people's names on there, I was like, oh, mama can't return it because then I, I, would, I would just, I wouldn't be able to sleep at night if I did deprive those babies of something. So there you go. I hope this was helpful and I'll talk to y'all soon. And just, you heard it here. Happy Mother's Day. Bye!